Tallulah Bankhead was derided in Hollywood for having moral turpitude, yet she never achieved the same level of fame as Greta Garbo, Marlena Dietrich or Joan Crawford. However, Bankhead's alter ego could outlive all of them. Few, if any, scandalous starlets can match Tallulah Bankhead in the Pantheon. Other actresses may have tried to keep their problematic actions a secret from the public, but Bankhead was blatantly honest about her life, possibly too honest. We are fully informed about Bankhead from her sexual relationships with co-stars to her truly famous comebacks, thanks to her ruthless honesty. Tallulah Bankhead was unbeatably resilient. She was labelled an unsafe and unsavoury person by the Hayes Commission as her career transitioned from enormous stage success in such hits as The Little Foxes and Fallen Angels to appearances in some of the worst plays ever written, which she turned into triumphs by improvising lewd and outrageous asides to satisfy the cravings of her predominantly homosexual audiences. Tallulah admitted to having over 500 relationships with both men and women, but she only got married once, to a guy who later divorced her on the grounds of mental abuse. At the height of her stardom, she was claimed to consume two bottles of bourbon each day, smoke 100 cigarettes and take sleeping pills, waking up pills to help her deal with the pills. She was a headline writer's dream throughout her life. However, whilst someone always appeared to be around to document Tallulah's transgressions, the other aspect of her personality mostly remained undocumented. She enthusiastically supported the presidential campaigns of Truman and Kennedy and raised a sizable sum of money for children's organisations. She also made strident speeches against communism, racial bigotry and sexual and gender discrimination. Tallulah loved to perform since she was a little child and Will would regularly carry her onto the dining room table so that she could perform risque songs for the males when they came over to the house after a night out. Tallulah was a stunning rebel who was always on display. When she didn't get her way, she would throw violent tantrums, which was another manifestation of her theatrical nature. She would fall to the ground, thrashing around on the ground, turn purple in the face, and scream bloody murder. However, her common-sense grandma merely threw a pail of water in her sister's face as she tried to hide in the closet. She lacked discipline and had no acting training, but she possessed striking beauty and charisma, and she was utterly driven to succeed. Although she dabbled with cocaine and alcohol, her primary shock techniques were sex. Although she enjoyed bragging about her erratic love life, it appears her first relationship was with the well-known actress Eva La Guillienne. At a party she confided in a stranger, I'm a lesbian, she added. I could never become a lesbian since they have no sense of humour, to her friend's statement. Click here to watch this video next.